Hi, and thanks for tuning in. I'd like to spend a few minutes and talk to you about another of the novel choices that you have for this course. The novel that I'd like to speak about is The Life of Pi by Jan Martel. So let's begin by talking about the author for a few minutes. Jan Martel is a Canadian author. Uh, both of his parents are from Quebec, although he was born in Spain when his parents were attending graduate school at a university uh, in Spain. Martel got a degree in philosophy from Trent University in Ontario and worked several odd jobs after he graduated from university. He always says it wasn't until he was at about the age of 27 that writing found him. His first two novels were not that successful. While he was in India on holidays, he says the idea for the novel Life of Pi just came to him. And it was, must have been a very good idea because the novel has sold over 12 million copies and has been adapted into an Oscar award-winning movie. He also won the Man Booker Prize for this novel. Martel currently lives in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. If you're going out to purchase the novel, this is one of the book jackets that you will find, but there are several others as well. So what is the life of Pi all about? <clears throat> well, as the novel suggests, um, it follows the development of the main character, Pai Patel. For about the first third of the novel, he is a young boy growing up with his family in the 1970s in India. He's a young fellow that's really interested in faith and the idea that to have faith means that we need to believe in things that cannot be scientifically proven. He visits a number of uh, religious uh, mosques and churches in India um, in order to find out more about them. So he um, learns about Hinduism, he learns about Islam, and he learns about Christianity. And while he finds that they all have differences, they have a lot of similarities as well. It's also about his family choosing to leave India because of the politics in India and emigrate to Canada. And they plan to take with them animals from the zoo that they own. And so uh, the next part of the book deals with uh, Pi ending up in a life raft with animals from the zoo and spending 227 days at sea. His character, which has been so well developed at the beginning of the novel, um, helps us understand how he can survive on this life raft. So it really is a novel about faith and survival, and it's a really good adventure story. As far as content warning, I don't think there are too many things that you will find triggering. There are some uh, situations of grief and loss and death and dying. Um, also a little bit of animal cruelty and perhaps some religious intolerance, but I don't think that these are major uh, factors in this novel. So I think you would really like this novel if you like a good adventure story. I think you'll really like the character of Pi and you'll uh, be very interested in his survival and um, his ideas on faith. If you like a novel that might leave you with some questions at the end um, and, you know, have you thinking about the meaning of life, then this is for you. And of course, because of the animals, if you love orangutans and tigers, you might be very interested in this novel. Martel is very expressive in his writing. Uh, he's also very good at creating suspense. I'd just like to look at this passage with you. Sometime during the night, the hyena began snarling and the zebra barking and squealing, and I heard a repeated knocking sound. I shook with fright and, I will hide nothing here, relieved myself in my pants. But those sounds came from the other end of the lifeboat. I couldn't feel any shaking that indicated movement. The hellish beast was apparently staying away from me. From nearer in the blackness, I began hearing loud expirations and groans and grunts and various wet mouth sounds. There were also noises coming from beneath me, from the water, sudden flapping sounds and swishing sounds that were over and done within an instant. The battle for life was taking place there too. So if you choose this novel, you'll get some very great descriptions and also suspense. I hope you enjoy it if it's your choice.